basic weave designs. Terms used in weaving. A woven fabric is produced by crossing the two thread systems of warp and weft. The thread crossing is called a woven pattern or weave texture. Repeating pattern. A weave texture is repeated in the cross and machine directions. The repeating pattern defines the smallest unit whose multiplication builds up the woven. It is also called rapport. Flotation. A flotation is the free, unbound fiber length of warp and weft threads between two or more interlacing points. Long flotations will result in a plain, even appearance of the fabric. Weave Diagram The weave diagram is a graphical sketch of the weave pattern on graph paper. Each square represents a potential interlacing point of warp and weft threads. It has been standardized to represent the warp threads in a vertical direction and the weft threads in a horizontal direction. Weave Symbol Weave patterns can be displayed with weave symbols. These are codes composed of repeated patterns of weave, number of warp threads up, number of warp threads down, number of threads, and shift counter. Basic Weave Patterns the three basic weave designs are, plain weave, twill weave, and satin weave. Plain weave. The plain weave pattern is the most basic as well as the tightest crossing of the warp and weft threads. The simplest interlacing pattern for warp and weft threads is over one and under one. The weave design resulting from this interlacement pattern is termed as plain or one-by-one one weave. The one-by-one one interlacement of yarns develops more crimp and fabric produced has a tighter structure. The variations of plain weave include warp rib, weft rib, and mat or basket weave. The plain weave and its variations can be produced with only two shafts. This pattern is also called tabby or linen weave. Twill weave. This weave is characterized by diagonal ribs across the fabric. It is produced in a stepwise progression of the warp yarn interlacing pattern while the interlacement pattern of each warp starts on the next filling yarn progressively. On the basis of the direction of the seam, Z and S twills are distinguished. The seam is caused by shifting the first warp thread or group of threads to the upper right. Some of the variations of twill weave include pointed, skip, and herringbone twill. Satin weave. Satin or sateen weave is characterized by longer floats of one yarn over several others. The satin weave is warp faced while sateen is a weft faced. The distance from one interlacing point to another on the next weft line is called shift. In one direction, this distance is always constant. A move number is used to determine the repeat of satin, and number of interlacements is kept to a minimum. Satin weave fabrics are more lustrous and have a closed, smooth, and dense appearance. If you really find this video helpful and informative, like, share, Subscribe and press the bell button.